Every now and then, a whole generation is united under the banner of a common purpose. There was a fantastic universal sense that we were part of something big, that we were winning. And maybe we let hubris get the better of us. Out of some naive sense of hope, we sat back and said our work here is done, and that change had been won before it ever really got started. We've come of age these past four years, and with the collapse of the economy, we built the foundation of a new millennium upon the spirit of our founding principles. Ours was a movement born in the streets, on the internet, at kitchen tables across a broad sweep of our terrain. And we stood in solidarity with the young across the globe as they expressed an almost primal urge for liberty. And now, in 2012, we encounter those who would reverse all the progress we've made. But this clock only moves forward. Never again will we return to lives lived in the closet. We will remain the custodians of our planet, locally engaged and globally connected. A country committed to the health and well-being of its citizens. The time has come to set aside childish things. The time has come to reaffirm our enduring spirit. Years from now, when we're old and gray, let us not look back at 2008 as the high watermark, that place where the wave finally broke and rolled back. But rather, let us say that it was only the beginning of a tide that kept rising, and that in 2012, we came together again, put our hands to the wheel, and took yet another great leap to move our nation forward. forward.